Have you been invited to a wedding this fall and you're looking for something to wear? If so, I've got some great choices for you here in this video. They're all from Amazon, all reasonably priced, and I think will be a perfect choice for an autumn wedding. Many of the dresses I'm going to show you in today's video take a cue from the autumn color palette, but this one I'm going to start with is the one I'm wearing right now, which is a beautiful dress with a sweetheart neckline in a gorgeous shade of navy. I think you can never go wrong with navy at a wedding. I just think it's always the classic choice and it works for all of the seasons of the year. So I just wanted to give a little nod out to this dress relatively new to my closet. I bought it in August. It travels beautifully. Um, and I, that's one thing that I really love about it. Now it does have kind of an inlaid pattern. If you can see here, there are little kind of flowers that are kind of inlaid into this very rich navy. It features a sweetheart neckline, a nicely fitting um, waist. The back comes down to the middle of your back. And I think it strikes a perfect balance with classy elegance at an autumn wedding. This next dress has been a favorite of mine for about four years now. And I just can't, um, I can't say enough good things about it. The mo thing I love the most about this dress is this beautiful pattern. I love this light brown with the flowers on it. I love the one shoulder look. It is an extremely flattering dress. On me, it comes almost all the way down to the ground because I'm only 5'4". Um, but if you are taller, it probably is gonna hit you at the ankle length. I think it is absolutely Absolutely perfect for a fall wedding and it looks really cute with a jacket over the top of it either a white cream blazer or if your wedding is a little more casual as they often are where I live a denim jacket in white or regular denim makes a really nice look for this one can't recommend this one enough I have worn it so many times since I've had it and I still love it are you liking this video if you are I wonder if you'd consider giving me a like shooting me a comment it helps so much and I really appreciate it Thank you. So instead of a dress for your fall wedding, why don't you consider a jumpsuit? This one here is one of my very favorites. I absolutely love this rich shade of rust. It has a little bit of interesting detail um, along the neckline and just a little bit of a peekaboo spot here in the front, but nothing that is too aggressive. It slips on and off very easily. And I think that this with a nice pair of heels would make a beautiful uh, presentation at a fall wedding. And also, I think it's going to keep you really comfortable if you are someone who prefers pants over dresses. It's easy to get on and off, so I don't think it's going to be too much of a problem in a restroom, but something to consider. Alta looks really nice with a jacket over the top of it. So I live in a rural area in the Northeast and where I live, it is very common to have weddings that are a little more uh, informal than some of the weddings that we see in more of the urban areas. A common trend where I live is to have your wedding at a barn, which has been refurbished for a wedding venue. And they really do, they're really very charming. They have a very rustic Adirondack like appeal to them. And a lot of times the weddings are outside and then we move inside for the reception. That is a beautiful setup, but it also can cause a little bit of an issue when it comes to the outdoor weather. So I have two dresses to show you that I think are perfect for a more casual wedding, especially if the venue is in a barn or Adirondack type situation. So the first one I want to show you is a favorite dress of mine in this lovely shade of chestnut brown. Um, this is definitely more of a sundress type look with the sleeveless thing. I love the several, uh, tears on this and the inlaid pattern and it looks exceptionally cute i'm showing it here with some nude sandals but it also looks really cute with a pair of cowboy boots or western boots if that is your thing and it really looks adorable with a denim jacket layered over the top of it um, but if you want to make it a little more formal you can wear it with pearls and some uh, nude slides as i have here and it can definitely transition into that as well I was just talking about outdoor weddings and the difficulty that they can pose in terms of footwear if you live in an area in the north where I do where it can be cold and wet. We just never really know what it's going to do. So um, I love the idea of wearing a boot to a wedding, a long dress with a boot underneath. It doesn't have to be a Western boot because I have some that are just white boots that I think make a really nice presentation. They look dressy, but also you're not going to sink into soggy ground and they're very comfortable and I can go all night in them. 
Now the Western trend is really hitting full stride. And so if that is something you are comfortable with and something you like, and it would be appropriate for the wedding venue, I'd like to suggest this wide square neck dress, which has, was a very popular one on Amazon two or three years ago. I think this is kind of um, like a, you know, just a very casual and fun dress to wear. I love the way it comes down tight on your waist and gives you a really nice um, line. And I also love the very wideness of this neck in the front and in the back as well. I think this beautiful shade of rust is perfect for a wedding. And I also really love it with these white cowboy boots that I just picked up at Marshall's. They're really cute, very comfortable. And I don't think they go overboard in terms of the Western trend. Now you could always throw a denim jacket on over the top of this or a little sweater if it's kind of chilly outside, but it definitely creates a festive Western type feel to it that is perfect for a wedding that is a little more on the informal side. Now, these next two dresses I want to show you are from the H&M website, and they actually still have them, which is surprising because things in H&M sell out so quickly. But I really like both of these dresses for a fall wedding. Um, this particular one is long sleeved and a very long dress. It definitely has a lot of room. There's a lot of material here, so it's kind of voluminous. And it comes with a little self-tie belt, which you can use, or you could switch it out for a belt of your own. But I loved this floral pattern. I bought it in late summer to take with me on a trip, but I think it's perfect for an early fall wedding. I love the shades of green and gold that are in this. It has longer sleeves. The only thing I will say is it has a slip that is sewn into it and it is very challenging to get this dress on. So much so that I ended up clipping the slip out of it and just putting the slip on first and then the dress over the top of it. Um, that seemed to work out a lot better because there were lots of layers to get through and it was a little frustrating. This dress looks beautiful with nude colored sandals, with um, a mule, or even with a white ankle booty. It's a really nice dress for a fall wedding that can look much more upper scale and much more formal. And finally, this is a dress I showed in a video uh, a few months ago, or at least last month, and it's still one of my very favorites to wear to a wedding or a shower or anything. This one is definitely more of a formal dress and definitely more of a conservative traditional style, but I think it is absolutely elegant and lovely in this beautiful shade of sage green. It features full pleating from the top of the shoulder all the way down to the bottom of the hem, a loose tie, and I just think it's such a beautiful dress. It looks absolutely elegant with a pair of heels or pumps and a blazer over the top of it, pairs beautifully with jewelry like pearls. And I think that this, this is a dress that I just don't think you could ever go wrong in. Um, you would always be elegant and somebody that people would say, hey, where did you get that dress? So if you want one of these last two dresses, I would maybe get on right away because it, they probably won't be available for much longer. So that's it for the dresses that I have to show you today. I think they're all pretty much perfect for a fall wedding. Um, and I think they strike that right balance. Some of them a little more formal than others, but I think that's how weddings are. They're definitely, that's how they are where I live for sure. Thank you for watching this video. And I would like to ask you if you liked it, if you would consider shooting it a like, giving me a comment. It helps so much in terms of the algorithm and helps me to get that video out to more people. Thanks again for watching. Hope you'll join me again in a few days for my next video, which is going to be on the Amazon two-piece set. I've got a lot of great choices for early fall. Hope to see you again.